I'm showing you a quick way to make a time lapse in iMovie. I shot this with a GoPro at a 10 second interval. So yeah, first of all you want to have your file with all the stuff in. Here's my file with everything I need, all my photos that I'm going to be using. So you want to go to iMovie, wait open that up, and then you go, I'll just import it all again. So you want to delete all of your stuff. Wait, you don't have to, but I'm just going to do it with neaten things up for me. So I'm just going to delete this um, out of there. Okay, so you want to say new movie and then just do what you want to name it. I'm just going to call it time lapse. Call it that. Okay, screw you then. Wait, just... Then you want to import your files you have, so I've got GoPro time lapse, so I'm just going to quickly make sure this is it. And you want to say click on here and say import to selected. Now I'll bring all the files from there into iMovie, and here I have them. So you want to click, you want to hold in command, click on the first one, and go down and click there, and then you say A, and I'll select all of them. And then you want to drag that down here. And then here's what it'll look like. Yeah, it looks quite bad with this thing. So what you want to do to remove that horrible effect, what I put in, you want to select all of them. And then you see here, it'll say Ken Burns. You do not want Ken Burns. You want to say Fit. And then it will take that horrible movement away. And then it will look way better. And then you want to go to Clip Information. And you want to tell this to go to... 0 comma 1 0 comma 1 and that will make it into the time lapse if yeah okay I never select okay I'm just gonna do that again quickly info 0 comma 1 0 comma 1 there 0 comma 1 okay so now that I have it at 0 comma 1 it will start to look more like the actual time lapse or this is what a time lapse looks like you'll see the clouds are moving in the sky looks quite cool um, if you want to take away these lines over here this is how you do it you want to go select all of it again and then you want to go here to the fit, I mean crop to fill. And this will let you select like a part of it which you want. So say I want to collect that much. And I'll take away these lines over here because this is not really that important. So I'll just go over here and then you want to click this little arrow here. And I'll reset it and then it'll look like this. So yeah, this is what it looks like. So my family and I went on a little walk early on today. So I just stuck the GoPro here and just made a little time lapse. So yeah, thanks for watching this tutorial. If you need any questions, um, just leave a comment and then I'll reply to you. And yeah, please like, comment and subscribe for skate videos and tutorials. Yeah.